Fox here with another episode on our level two of our mini Mario adventure. And today I want to show you guys how to start putting in a character jump for our Mario. So we want to start coding that, but we want to make it simple. We don't want to use gravity. So let me just jump straight into Scratch and show you where we're going to get to today. All right, so here I am in Scratch and I've got a second Mario now. Um, and we've got him so that when he goes left and right, he moves, but he's got that jump in there. So in my costumes, if I go in here, I've added a frame at the beginning so that he's standing forward and I've added all of my jump frames. So I've got jump one down to jump eight. So that's what we're going to do today. So let's get to it. So this is where we ended off in our last episode. We added our level two screen and we learned how to make all of our stuff hide so that we have a level two screen that's nice and blank and empty. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna duplicate my Mario. So I'm gonna right click and duplicate. So then I need to go and add in all of our new pictures for animation. So I'm gonna go to costumes and I need to upload all of my costumes that I want for the jump. And then I'm also gonna upload that costume of him standing facing the camera. Don't forget when you're doing this that you need to select each picture and move it a little bit just to get it to show up properly. All right, so I've got all my jump pictures in here. So I have eight total jump pictures. So one to eight. And what I wanna do is right now they're all centered. So they're all in the same spot. So if I click through them, it doesn't really look like a jump. So the way we're going to make it look like he's jumping is we're just going to change some of our frames so that he's higher in the picture. So when we actually play through all of the pictures, you'll see him go up and down without us actually having to add in code for gravity. Okay, so to do that, I'm just going to go to some of my pictures and you'll have to play around with this um, and you'll have to play around with it probably once you put in the code and actually see what it looks like. Um, but I'm just going to go in for some of my pictures and I'm going to start moving him upward. So I'm just going to select everything and use the up arrow. Um, if I move him around just with the mouse, he might move left and right and then it won't look very smooth when I jump. So I'm just going to use the arrow keys to move him up and down. And I'm going to do that to a few of these and I'm going to make it so that one is a little bit lower so he's starting to jump, one's a bit higher so that he's at like the highest point of his jump, right? And then the next one, he's going to come down from his jump. So I'm going to put him really high but then I'm going to bring it down a little bit so that he looks like he's coming down. So I can click through them and I can see what that looks like. And I'm gonna do the same thing to this one. I'm gonna move it up a bit. He's almost to the ground, so his legs have come together and he's ready to reach for the ground. And that'll be this one where he's a bit closer to the ground. He's almost there. And then the next one is where he lands on the ground. Okay, so if I click through my pictures now, he goes up and then comes back down. So now if I go and I play, I'm going to show you a trick here because right now it's going to play right from the beginning and to test your game, you don't want to have to start from the beginning every single time now that we have level two. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my backdrop and I'm going to switch when green flag clicked, I'm going to switch my backdrop for now just to my Mario background two, and it'll straight jump straight to my level two so that I don't have to play through all of my stuff. Now I need to remember that my new duplicated Mario, I actually want him to show up on Mario background two, and I want him to disappear on Mario background. So now that I switch that, now if I hit the green flag, he shows up, he's way up there. So I'm gonna bring him down, perfect. And now if I press my arrow keys, he runs, he does his little animation. So you can actually see him jump now, which is pretty good. So you can go and check and make sure that that jump looks right. And in the next video, I'm going to show you guys how to clean up this code so that he doesn't automatically jump without you telling him to. So that's it for our first episode of how to do a simple jump with our Mario. So it's just adding in those animation pictures and putting them in the right spots to make it look like he is jumping up and over something. So thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you subscribe below if you haven't already. And we'll see you next time. Bye!